May is Mental Health Awareness Month, and in honor of that, one ASU athlete is sharing her story with mental illness. Women's basketball's Robbie Ryan spoke one-on-one -on -one with our own Cheerston Susell. Mental illness didn't really grab a hold of me until the summer between my freshman and sophomore season at ASU. I silently struggled for a long time, just waiting for it to get better. I had been consumed by my depression and it didn't just affect basketball. It turned everything in my life upside down. Athletes, they've always been coached to be tough and no matter if they feel hurt or they, they're supposed to play through everything. So I think that um, kind of transfers into even when you're like sad or feeling down, um, that's just kind of the mindset and it's not necessarily the best mindset to have. ASU guard Robbie Ryan finished her senior campaign with all Pac-12 honors as the team's second leading scorer. She made the conference academic honor roll and is now just a few classes shy of a master's degree. But at one point, she was ready to walk away. Eventually, I just kind of like broke down and knew, you know, that like something wasn't right and I needed to start like facing, you know, those feelings and, um, when that time came, it was obviously very difficult. For her to be able to continue to compete, continue to excel in school, to, to lead while she's fighting through all this, I mean, that just, that tells you what kind of young woman Robbie Ryan is. With the help of teammates, coaches, and counselors, Robbie has been able to fight past a battle with clinical depression and is now sharing her story living my truth and putting my truth out there is it's very free, freeing and I was kind of nervous when this first got published but after the feedback I don't know it was just an amazing feeling that you know even sharing my struggles could help somebody with theirs. Although it's a constant journey Robbie feels she's made it past the worst and is hoping her story will help others going through a similar situation. There will be a lot of people that might have just been like you know Charlie I'm out. And I, I think she felt like that at times. I know she did, you know, and she just kind of trusted in the people around her that we could help her, you know, get through it. And, uh, and she did, and she's an amazing success story. Robbie said that putting pen to paper is also something that's really helped her out. She'd write about certain emotions and her journey with mental health, even while traveling to away games. Some of what she's written is published on the ASU Athletics website. Cheerson Soussel, 12 Sports.